The school released a statement today, the school superintendent, superintendent and it was specifically um, seemed to be motivated or addressing Bob Bocox present in Leroy over the weekend. So, Bob, I want you to respond to this. You there? Yes, Dr. Okay, here we go. Here's the statement. Over the past few days, activities that have occurred in our community with respect to environmental testing by a representative who claimed to be working on behalf of Aaron Brockovich have taken center stage. This has been a distraction and taken us away from our mission to return normalcy to our school district. It was clearly staged as a publicity stunt with members of local and national media invited to participate. There you go, Bob. Is that you're just allegedly associated with Aaron, or you are, and this was all a big publicity stunt? Yeah, uh, I'll tell you, Aaron and I have been together for over 15 years. We investigate uh, somewhere over 500 uh, cases like this on an annual basis, of which over 100 of them will actually physically go out into the field, much like we did in Leroy. At every instance, we are invited into the community by the members of the community, by, by family members, and, and by people that are concerned with their environment and sickness. So in this case, you were stonewalled, and then your, your credibility is called into, into question, as well as you've duped us into following you there, I guess, huh? Yeah, I, you know, I'm a big boy, and <clears throat> Aaron and I have been called a lot of things over the years, but I think this is probably the first time we've ever been called criminal. Oh, my goodness. Well, and, uh, uh, you know, that, that, you know, this morning when this was brought to my attention, there was a bit of an outrage, and, and, and frankly, that's downgraded to just kind of almost pathetically sad. Well, Ann, let me go to you. Um, why is the school taking aim at everybody else? Uh, is somebody dropped the ball there? Are they concerned about something? It seems like they should welcome in reviewers. They should, and our organization um, and others are calling for the state environmental and health agencies and the federal environmental protection agency to work with the school. Those are the environmental health experts that should be working with the school to do a transparent environmental investigation that looks fully at whether there's any possible toxic exposure pathways and rules them out once and for all. The school has not done an adequate job of looking into that. They need the expertise of the state and federal agencies to work together on a transparent environmental investigation. And, and I understand you have had contact with the EPA and you feel as though their response has been adequate. The EPA has moved, moved quickly to, to address concerns as is investigating various pathways of toxic exposure, um, but they're hampered. They need to work with the school, they need to work with the state environmental and health agencies to do a comprehensive investigation that looks at the gas wells, looks at two state Superfund sites in the town of Leroy, a federal Superfund site right near, you know, a couple miles from Leroy, as well as other pa and pathways I, I of exposure. And I've got to interrupt. I'm, I'm out of time. I appreciate your input. I'll be looking to you for more.